Hello and welcome to the Lightning Fast series with the Informatica Cloud. Today we're going to talk about setting up your Oracle connection. Let's go ahead and get started. So here in the Informatica Cloud is where you set up your Oracle connection. Um, the first two lines are the basic details of um, what you want to call that connection. So this can be anything that you want as long as you know what it is in regards to connecting to this Oracle. Uh, the next section is the properties. So of course you pick Oracle from the list um, and that is only one option there to pick. Um, you can do username and password. This is what you're using to log into PLSQL right now or Toad or whatever Oracle username and password your administrator gave you. Um, the host is the name of the server that you're connecting to, where Oracle lives, right? So this is either a fully qualified domain name like something.something.com um, or it's local host, meaning that it's the same server as the agent. I'm running the free version of Oracle, so it's all on the same computer. And then, of course, you have a port, which is 1521 by default, but if your administrator changed it, you just put it right there. Uh, service name is XE, um, in my opinion, uh, or in my case, because this is the free version of Oracle. Um, your administrator will give you this as well. What a service name is, is if you have multiple different version or instances of Oracle run on the same server, um, all those different instances have different names. Uh, schema is uh, most of the time the same as your username, although this is essentially the database that you're using in Oracle. Um, almost every time it's your user and your, your username, but uh, your administrator might have given you a different one. So it depends on how it's set up. But this goes back to whatever you uh, got from your administrator. Um, code page is, uh, you know, most people just stick with that. If you have special characters, you can pick the UTF-8. And then, of course, the agent that you want to connect to this Oracle is an agent that has access to that Oracle. And this is wherever your agent's installed. Uh, so I can come over here and I can test my connection. I'm good. Uh, let's go jump over here into our server and let's see if we can connect to Oracle. So we can go a new connection. Notice this is the same information I just used. XE, demo, there's my password, connect as normal. Um, this right here um, is where I can connect using my instance. So if you take a look, this is the toad information about where all this stuff is. Uh, now, if this doesn't work for you, you can also go into the file system, and if you have an Oracle client installed on your computer, and you always do, uh, tnsnames.ora file, and now you'll notice that it should be the same as my connection. So there's the XE um, that we lined up with. There's also the host, which is localhost, right? This will be your name of the server where Oracle lives, and then the port. And thank you very much for your time.